hurt anything. Can you see that okay? There we go. Look at this thing. This thing is nice. Look at this. Uh, the box says it's about 20 pounds. It's good size. I mean, it's beefy. You got brushes in the back. You got, there's the tracks. This is kind of cool. It looks like it funnels. So I'm assuming this is the front. That looks like a sensor. Here's your front brushes. You got back brushes. These side pieces of rubber here are going to funnel the debris to the hole here. So yeah, cool. Okay, I'm going to uh, start charging it. Let me read up on it. That way I'm a little more informed. Okay, so the first thing I figured out is this thing talks to you. <laughs> it's pretty cool. Check this out. Blue box starts charging now. Why, thank you. Okay, we are back. I don't know what else to do. It has been raining every single day for the last week. I just posted a tornado to uh, video yesterday or last night um, from storms uh, from last Saturday. So it's just been crazy. I was hoping that the sun was shining and this thing would look a little more beautiful than it already does. But I've got to work with what I what I have. So <clears throat> okay, it is fully charged. It is ready to go. Now, because we have had so many storms and rain, the pool is atrocious. There's some leaves out there. There's dirt all through the whole. I kind of feel bad doing a review when it's this bad, but I mean, I guess we're gonna figure out what it's made of, right? And uh, I don't know, we'll see what it can do here. Let me get it in the water. All right, it is time to get it in the pool and we'll let it go. Let's power it on. Okay, when you first start it, it starts in all cover mode. You don't have to set it to do just that. And if you wanted something different, like, you know, the walls or something, then you would set it differently. Usually they take a little while before they get going. And again, this thing kind of has to program itself a little bit. So I wouldn't be surprised to see it kind of going back and forth for a little bit. It is lit up blue. There it goes. Let me get a camera in the water and see if we can wash it a little bit. I figure while you're checking out the underwater footage I shot with my GoPro, I'd go ahead and go over some uh, numbers with this particular unit. Uh, the different cleaning modes and what the lights mean, that type of things. So it has three basic cleaning modes. It's got an all cover, which means it'll do the floors and the walls. It also has an option just to work on the walls or an option just to work on the floors. When you first power this thing on and put it in the water, it is automatically set to everything, so you don't really have to, to worry about it there. Um, as far as the lights go, red light means um, it's it's low battery or it's charging. Um, the battery light is one, one and a half hours. However, I got two hours out of my battery on this first run, so I was pretty impressed with that. The charging time is two and a half hours approximately, and this thing moves at about 59 feet per minute across the, uh, the pool bottom. It's for pools uh, 1,614 square foot at a depth of 16.4. Um, the different lights that you're going to see, a blue light is working mode, it's, it's ready to go, it's, it's moving across the pool. Uh, green light, fully charged, red light, low battery charging, purple light, it's having trouble getting out of a situation. It might be stuck behind a ladder or it's, it's, it's got an issue, pull it out and uh, get it restarted. If you're seeing a yellow light, that means there's something wrong with the unit. You need to pull it out, power it off and try to troubleshoot what you can. As you can see, the ladder doesn't bother it either. It'll climb the ladder. It just got stuck under the ladder and worked its way out with no problem. The 
this thing is just so strong. It climbs the wall, and that basket is full of debris. This thing was filthy, and it's a, it, the basket's getting really full. You could see it, but it's still doing its thing. I don't know if you could see from the video, but the debris box is like completely full, and this thing is still going somehow. Okay, this thing has been going on. The box says an hour and a half runtime. It's been going for two hours. I'm about to stop it because the clouds are getting more gray by the second. And I wanna finish this video before the storm starts. Okay, now before I go to hook this thing, I do wanna remind everybody, I don't care what robot you have, when you go to pull it out of the pool, it is gonna drop a little debris from the bottom basket. It's just gonna happen. Let me see if I can catch it. Come here, little buddy. Yeah, you're done. Oh, no, you don't. You got away, huh? I got you. Okay, let's get out of the pool. Okay, he's probably not happy because I pulled him out before he's done. Enjoy your pool. Goodbye. Please enjoy your pool. Goodbye. I just powered it off. Okay. Pop this here. Pop that there. Lift that right there. And enjoy all the junk it has captured. Look at that, this thing is full. All right, let me pop it open and get my hose over here. Okay, so I've got my hose over here. First thing I'm gonna do, there is some dirt in there. Just rinse that off. Just like that. Okay, now with this part here, got two little clips on the sides. Gonna take that off. leaf in there we'll get him out he's out okay look at this it captured all of that stuff this is a very uh tight mesh that is going to collect a lot of sand a lot of dirt a lot of grime that thing is full of stuff hold on look at that Hose this off just like that. That is a lot of junk. Well, time to wrap up another video. I am extremely impressed with this product, extremely impressed. This thing like was just a beast, climbing walls. It cleaned the entire pool. I'm gonna show you here at the end what the pool looks like now. I have a brief little moment of uh, partial sunshine and I want to show you how clean it got the pool before it started to rain again. <laughs> was in the beginning it is complete night and day um, after storms and leaves and dirt and everything else it is clean I'm very happy with it I would give it an A plus plus I mean this thing is awesome you can get it on special sometimes on Amazon um, I will link it in the description I also wanted to add one thing when you if you're gonna pack this up for the winter just make sure you dry all this stuff off before you you store it away you don't want to pack it away wet um, I will personally actually wipe it down before I start recharging it again but I'm going to throw it on the charger so it's uh, ready for next time. And uh, as always, thank you for watching another video and supporting this channel the way you do. And uh, let's just hope we don't get another tornado <laughs> coming our way today. So God bless everyone. Thank you for watching.